All right, guys, thanks so much. Yeah, we're happy to have Trip Therapeutics back with us on Good the show once again this afternoon. Uh, the pharmaceutical company who is uh, focused on developing psilocybin-based compounds for diseases and uh, unmet medical problems uh, in the mental health space. Uh, CEO and Chairman Greg McKee uh, back on the show once again. Uh, great to see you, Greg. So, uh, so great that. to have you back on the show. Uh, tell us about the latest developments here for TRIP. Uh, two, not one, but two new uh, investigational drug filings for the company. Yes, well, thanks so much for having me back on the show. Really appreciate it. Um, two, yeah, two big developments for us as we've been getting ready to initiate our clinical trial. So as you mentioned, we just filed our second investigational new drug application, or IND is called in the space, for fibromyalgia with, through our partnership with the University of Michigan. The first was with the University of Florida, with Jennifer Miller's lab, uh, which we filed last month, and we're just navigating through last little steps with the Food and Drug Administration. Um, and both those studies we anticipate being in a position to start dosing patients here just right around the corner. So we're pretty excited about those developments at the company. So two new filings. In addition to that, we have two new uh, phase two studies to uh, talk about as well. Uh, tell us a little bit about these studies and where we are at. What stage is the company at? Yeah, that's right. So, so we've got a total of four phase two A clinical trials that we anticipate having teed up here shortly. The first two INDs are already in, uh, been, been filed, as I mentioned. They're both open label trials. One's in the eating disorder space. The other one is in fibromyalgia. We're working with Dr. Dan Cloth, the University of Michigan, who is the leading expert in fibromyalgia, which we're really excited about. And then we've got two additions. So that phase 2A study with uh, Florida is an open label, 10 patient study, so relatively modest in terms of numbers of patients. But the exciting news is that we're going to likely have a readout from that trial at some point in the early part of 2022, so just right around the corner in the either first or second quarter of next year, which we're really excited about. And then we've got the second trial in fibromyalgia. We've got two other clinical studies um, that are teed up with two additional academic collaborators, both of whom are based here in California. They're both part of the UC University of California academic system in two other uh, chronic pain indications including complex regional pain syndrome and phantom limb pain. So we're pretty excited because, you know, compared to other companies in the psychedelic drug development space, we're going to have these four phase 2A clinical trials, uh, which put us, puts us in pretty rarefied air on top of the fact that we're working in some therapeutic areas with patients that, that uh, really not a lot of other companies are looking at at this time. And important uh, data to come from these studies, obviously. We, uh, we look forward to another uh, update in the future when we do get some more uh, data points from these. Uh, let's talk about uh, another development uh, here, Greg, for the company, and that is a brand new website, a uh, totally revamped website, including uh, more educational content in this space. Tell us about it. Yeah, so, so you know, of course, like getting, getting the word out about what we're doing is obviously critical. We, we love this new website for, for you know, two basic reasons. One, it just tells the story so much better than before. You know, honestly, you know, being able to, to work off the website, being able to work off our new deck now is just such a privilege. It really gives, you know, our perspective, um, looking at everything from a patient's angle, right, and trying to solve these unmet medical needs. The website does a great job of that storytelling. And then, as you mentioned, there are a number of fantastic assets. So for those that really want to dive into the data, there's lots of data there. There's videos from you know, people like Kevin Banke, who's our principal investigator in the fibromyalgia study. There's a lot of literature there, though, for those that want to go and you know, dive deep into the publications. Uh, and we have a lot of other information you know, as well that's readily accessible right there you know, at your fingertips uh, on the keyboard at our website. So really happy about that additional development as well. Triptherapeutics.com, uh, guys, if anyone's looking for more information, T-R-Y-P, uh, therapeutics.com, if you want to uh, check out their website. Uh, the company also very, very close to dosing its first patient uh, in these trials that we were talking about. Uh, what is to come? Greg, tell us what to expect as far as TRIP is concerned as we head into yeah, yeah. not only Q4, but uh, next year as well. Yes, yes. So the, the exciting thing about having, you know, four phase 2A clinical studies, uh, as well as working on a novel formulation and a novel route administration for our kind of our secret sauce, as we call it, is that's going to generate lots of, you know, both, you know, short and medium term news flow. So each one of these clinical trials will have announcements about fine INDs, like we were talking about today. We'll be dosing our first patients, as you already mentioned, just right around the corner. And then we'll have these data readouts that will be happening over the next, you know, few quarters or so, as well as being in a position to disclose the specifics around our unique uh, approach to using psilocybin. So 
pretty excited about what the news flow means and what that could mean uh, for investors in our shares. We think it's a great time to get involved in the story right now. TRYP is the uh, ticker symbol here listed on the uh, CSE in uh, Toronto. Uh, you can also check them out in the U.S., TRYPF on the OTC markets. Uh, Greg McKee, Chairman and CEO of Trip Therapeutics. Uh, always a pleasure, Greg. Uh, we look forward to another update. Yeah, look forward to coming back again. Thank you. Thanks so much, guys. Uh, Trip Therapeutics.